This is my mom. This is my audience. Hello. Before I start this piece, I'd like to paint a story to you. Imagine you're sitting in class and you get a text from your friend about a formal event. You say, yes, you're going to go. So you leave class, you head to your dorm, and you find your best clothes. You find a polo shirt and some jeans. You put it on, you think you look good, and you head out the door. When you get to the event, you walk in, and you're surprised to see that everybody in the event is wearing a dress shirt and a tie. You feel underdressed, you feel embarrassed, and you don't have a good time the entire night. The story that I'm talking about is my personal story, and this is why I'm giving this speech to you today. My name is Adrian Stats, and today I'm going to teach you how to tie a tie. More specifically, a half Windsor knot. First of all, Pop Science Magazine says that there's over 770,000 ways to tie a necktie. This is just one of them. If you like pictures instead, you can go search Google, The Art of Manliness, Necktie Guide. So I'm going to have seven steps, seven steps. And then, so I'm going to start. Well, step zero, it's an extra step. You need a tie. You can't really, you really can't do this if you don't have a tie. But step one, you're going to drape the tie around your neck. It's going to be like this. The second part of step one, you're going to grab the large piece of the tie. You're going to cross it over the small piece. You're going to keep hold of that like that. Grab hold of the intersection. Step two, you grab that large piece. You remain holding the intersection right here. But you grab that large piece with the other hand, you bring it back behind that piece that you were holding. And you clamp that down, it'll be like this. Step three, you grab that large piece and there's gonna be a separation hole between your neck and the, where you're holding it. You're gonna grab that large piece for step three. You're gonna bring it up and through that hole. That was step three. Step four, you you're still holding this piece, but for step four, you grab that large piece again, you wrap it around where you're holding, like so, step four. You keep holding it, still handling the large piece of the other hand. And then step five, you grab that large piece, you put it back through the hole that you worked with earlier. But instead of bringing it up and in, you're going to bring it, come from the bottom and put it through. That's step five. It's going to look like so. And step six, grab that large piece. You're going to fill a lip right here with your hand. It's going to be like a hole. You can put your finger through there. And that's where the large piece of the tie is going to go in. Step six, you grab that large piece. You put it through that hole. Like so. And you have a tie knot, but it's not tight. So step seven. Step seven, you need to tighten your tie. So now I'm going to show you how to tighten your tie, and this is step seven. To tighten your tie, it's going to look like this. You're going to have a large piece on top, you're going to have a small piece on, on the bottom, like behind it. You're gonna grab that small piece and you're gonna grab your tie knot with the other hand. You're gonna keep hold of the small piece, but with the hand holding the tie knot, you're gonna move up like this. You're gonna jimmy it around a little bit until it touches your neck. That's how you tighten your tie. That's step seven. And now you have a half Windsor knot. Just to summarize, I'm gonna go back through the steps I'm gonna go pretty fast though. I'm just gonna name the steps. So you start step one, cross the tie. Step two, bring the large piece back behind. Step three, bring the large piece up and through the hole. Step four, bring the large piece around, around the knot that you made. Step six, step five, you bring it 
up and through that hole. And step six, you grab that large piece and you put it down through that lip that you feel. You can put your finger in there and that's where the tie goes. And then you have a tie, you have a, a tie knot ready to loosen. So then you need step seven, which is how to tighten your tie. You grab the small piece behind, you grab the knot, you keep the hand with the small piece firm, you grab the knot and you move the hand with the knot, you move it upwards. You might have to jiggle it around a little bit and you pull it up until it slightly touches your neck and you have a tightened tie. You have a tightened Windsor knot, like so. This is how it look. This is called a Windsor knot. And then you don't want your tie hanging out. So you put it in your jacket if you're wearing one. This is how it look. Now, hopefully that I've done this speech on how to tie a tie, you'll never go through the situation that I went through that I mentioned earlier with the formal event. So, the tie wins or not, there are seven steps. And then you'll have a tie like this. My name is Adrian Stats, and today I, ta I taught you how to have tie a wins or not and how to tie a necktie. Thank you.